Understanding blood sugar levels, when is it dangerous? Welcome back to our channel, where we share valuable insights on living a healthy life with diabetes. Today, we're diving into a topic that every person with diabetes needs to understand. Blood sugar levels and when they become dangerous. I'm your host, a certified diabetes expert ready to guide you through this important information. Introduction to blood sugar levels. Let's start by understanding what blood sugar levels are and why they matter. Blood sugar, or glucose, is the primary source of energy for our bodies. For people with diabetes, managing blood sugar levels is crucial to maintaining overall health. The measurement of blood sugar levels is usually expressed in milligrams per deciliter, milligram per deciliter, or millimoles per liter, MMOLL. Normal blood sugar levels. Before we discuss dangerous levels, let's establish what's considered normal. In a fasting state, typically before breakfast. A healthy range for blood sugar levels is between 70 to 99 mg per deciliter, 3.9 to 5.5 mmol. However, it's important to note that normal levels may vary slightly depending on individual circumstances and the type of diabetes. Hypoglycemia now, let's explore dangerous levels of blood sugar, starting with hypoglycemia. Hypoglycemia occurs when blood sugar drops too low, usually below 70 mg per deciliter, 3.9 mmol. This can be caused by skipping meals, over-exercising, excessive insulin or medication dosage, or alcohol consumption without sufficient food intake. Symptoms of hypoglycemia include shakiness, dizziness, confusion, irritability, sweating, rapid heartbeat, and, in severe cases, loss of consciousness. It's vital to treat hypoglycemia promptly by consuming a fast-acting carbohydrate, such as fruit juice or glucose tablets, to raise blood sugar levels. Hyperglycemia On the other end of the spectrum, we have hyperglycemia, which refers to high blood sugar levels. While normal blood sugar levels may vary slightly, consistently high readings often indicate hyperglycemia. The threshold for danger varies depending on factors such as age, overall health, and individual circumstances. For most adults with diabetes, blood sugar levels exceeding 180 mg per deciliter, 10 mmol, 2 hours after meals can be considered dangerous. Prolonged hyperglycemia increases the risk of complications such as nerve damage, kidney disease, cardiovascular issues, and eye problems. Recognizing hyperglycemia symptoms. It's crucial to recognize the symptoms of hyperglycemia early on to prevent complications. Some common symptoms include frequent urination, excessive thirst, unexplained weight loss, fatigue, blurred vision, slow wound healing, and recurrent infections. Regular blood sugar monitoring is essential to catch high readings and take appropriate action. Dangers of long-term hyperglycemia. Let's delve deeper into the dangers of prolonged hyperglycemia. Persistently high blood sugar levels can lead to diabetic ketoacidosis, DICA, in people with type 1 diabetes. A potentially life-threatening condition characterized by the presence of ketones in the blood. In individuals with type 2 diabetes, Chronic hyperglycemia can result in a hyperosmolar hyperglycemic state, HHS. A dangerous condition characterized by extreme dehydration and high blood sugar levels. Both DKA and HHS require immediate medical attention. Managing blood sugar levels. As a diabetes expert, I want to emphasize the importance of managing blood sugar levels effectively. Always consult with your healthcare team to set personalized target ranges for your blood sugar levels. They will guide you on medication dosages, dietary modifications, exercise routines, stress management, and overall diabetes self-care. Tips for maintaining healthy blood sugar levels. Here are some general tips for maintaining healthy blood sugar levels. 1. Consistently monitor your blood sugar levels using a reliable glucometer. 2. Eat a balanced diet rich in whole grains, lean proteins, healthy fats, and plenty of fruits and vegetables. 3. Engage in regular physical activity, as exercise helps lower blood sugar levels. 4. Take medications or insulin as prescribed by your healthcare team. 5. Stay hydrated and limit alcohol consumption. 6. 
Minimize stress levels through relaxation techniques like meditation or yoga. 7. Regularly visit your healthcare team for checkups and follow-up appointments. Conclusion. That brings us to the end of today's video on understanding dangerous blood sugar levels. Remember, hypoglycemia and hyperglycemia can both pose significant risks to our health. So, it's crucial to know the symptoms and take appropriate action promptly. By working closely with your healthcare team and adopting a well-rounded approach to diabetes management, you can maintain healthy blood sugar levels and reduce the risk of complications. Stay tuned to our channel for more diabetes-related content. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and share it with others. And, as always, subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with our latest videos. Thank you for watching, and until next time, stay healthy.